So with, with the menu of services, and I'm, I'm critical of this from a business standpoint, do they charge different fees for different services? So myofascial release, trigger point, Swedish, deep tissue, Thai, and they've all got like different session links and then they've all got different prices. What I find happens, and this is, you tell me if you guys think otherwise. When you go to a restaurant, are you really impressed when they have a, they sell everything? It's, it's overwhelming. I think they did some research recently and people actually had more anxiety like choosing out a breakfast cereal. <laughs> like they'd pick a breakfast cereal but they kept thinking, well, there's like 30 other FOMO. breakfast cereals and maybe if I, what is it? FOMO. What, is it, what does it mean? Fear of missing out. Fear of missing out. Yeah. They're, they're concerned that even though they, they picked one, like the other ones might have been better. But if you minimize the number of choices, it reduces that. And there, there are lots of ways to go about that. I don't remember a time at which McDonald's did anything other than, give me a number one, give me a number two. And I guarantee you, whoever came up with that one, they deserve millions of dollars because they saved Americans a huge amount of time. Because they used to say, I want a hamburger. Wait, I don't want onions. Can you add cheese? Do you want fries with that? Do you see how long it takes? If they go up and say, listen, I want a number one, and I want it with no onions. It's streamlined that process. When you have 20 different things, especially as a massage therapist, on your menu of services, what stands out? The most recognizable one, Swedish, because that's what everybody knows. Anxiety stands out. The first one on the list. Yeah, I don't think anything really stands out. So if you, do, if you do 20 things, what are you good at? So here's what I did, and this is me, and I'm just addressing it from my perspective. I realized at a certain point I wasn't selling massage. So here's what's on my menu of services currently. I have a three hour reboot, it's $240. And I have a 90 minute belly reboot. There's a number one and number two, that's it. There is no massage, there is no 90 minutes, there is no hour, there is no 30 minutes. And people say, wait, but don't people call you and say, I want a massage? And I say, listen, my work is really high grade manual therapy. If you're looking for a massage, like have you had massage before? And they say, no, I, I've never had massage, but I saw your Yelp profile and you had like all these five star reviews. And I go, okay, I'm a little bit like the deep end of the pool. I'd, I'd really be happy to work on you, but what I think you might wanna do is to find a massage therapist and go get a simple kind of table massage to get started. And if you decide you're looking for more, you can come see me. It's like you're almost pushing people away a little bit. But what I'm trying to do is draw the clients who really want to work with me. Who wants a three-hour mat-based session? <laughs>